Good day everyone. In this video today, I will show you how to upload zip file in Google Drive. So to do this, first you log into your Gmail account, then when done, click on this Google app icon, then click on Drive to continue. So right now as you can see, I'm lo I've logged into my Google Drive. So the next thing for you to do is just to go to the zip folder which you want to upload. So let's go to desktop. As you can see, here's a zip folder right here. So here is the zip folder which I'll be using. So what you have to do is just to firstly right create a new folder. Right click on the desktop, new, then click on folder. So you can give the folder a name, tech folder. So when done with that, the next thing for you to do is just to double click to open your zip folder. As you can see, here's the zip folder, and here is a file inside it. So what you have to do is just to Let's double click on the file inside it. Then you can then copy all the file, which is all the file inside. If it's a folder or anything which is inside, just copy the file inside it. So right click on it, then click on copy file to clipboard. So when done, let's minimize this. Then the next thing for you to do is also open the folder which you create. So you can then paste what you copied into it. So right now, as you can see, I've just pasted this to file. So the next thing for you to do is just to open your browser. As you can see, we have logged into the Google Drive already. The next thing for you to do is just to click on New, then click on Folder Upload. So you can then select the location where the folder is. So mine is on my desktop. So you can then scroll down. As you can see, the folder name is Tech Folder. So click on it, then you click on Open. Then you click on Upload to continue. So right now, as you can see, the folder has been uploaded. The next thing for you to do to check your folder is just to click on this icon in front of this my drive right here. Then you can then scroll down as you can see tech folder, click on it, and you see all those files inside it. So that was how to do this. Hope this video help. Please give it a thumb up and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you in the next video.